What's up, YouTube? Hudson Fan 15. Uh, got a couple pieces of mail in. First up, a little trade bait for you guys. Saw this going and decided to put in a bid on it. Uh, I know there's a lot of you Boston fans out there. And I know there's also a lot of people who collect triple threads out there. So figure for the price, really couldn't go wrong on it. Uh, 2008 triple threads baseball uh, I'm guessing this is like that that tannish or sepia toned variation 10 of 27 it's a black jersey black jersey I'm guessing it's probably the same piece and then bat 4 SS which I'm guessing is for silver sluggers uh, yep four sil uh, silver sluggers and that is David Big Poppy Ortiz. I mean, there we go. Not nearly as much glare there. As you can see, it is a bright, sunshiny day outside here in Connecticut, but it is like 25 degrees and the wind is blowing at about 50. So it is not fun walking outside. You, you, you open a door and you step out and you go sideways. Uh, next up, uh, another eBay seller, uh, Colts uh, PC 2009 certified emerald 5 of 5 parallel, seems to be a theme, uh, Reggie Wayne, who uh, played a little bit this weekend. He didn't, uh, he didn't need to really do a whole lot, but uh, <laughs> they, they decided to dial it down early anyway, and I am thankful that I decided to bench him in my fantasy league uh, and uh, I won both championships both leagues that I'm in so two for two on that thanks to Tom the Ripper Rich Sly Fox definitely uh, Renroy82 Chris for the, for the late trade um, Dole USMC uh, Miss April for participating just a lot of fun this year uh, wish which would be a little bit more active, but uh, did what I could, and I was I was certainly the. If you look at, if you actually looked at the league. I was definitely the most active participant. Um, next up, this eBay seller has put up this lot. Uh, this was, I believe, the fourth attempt at listing this. He had it violently overpriced the first couple of times. Uh, the last one was ballpark reasonable. I know I put offers in for more than what I ended up paying for it, and you guys know I just love it when that happens. You know, the, these these eBay sellers don't understand how small the market for Hudson really can be, and uh, I, I ended up getting this this whole lot here for under thirty-two dollars shipped. So here goes, starting off with the numbered, uh, got a 06 co-signers, one fourteen out of one twenty-five. Uh, same card, same set, pretty much. Uh, fifty-nine and one twenty-five. Uh, then the following year is the 08, uh, 10 of three hundred, kind of bronzish parallel. And then the green parallel with Chuck James, and that is numbered sixty-seven of two hundred. Uh, and we have the. Uh, they call these things. One of Don Russ sets. The, this is the one that's like the old style card game that they used to do. Uh, this is the ball. Long three base hit. 29 of 55. And then the strike. Short fly to right field out. That is 8 of 20. Uh, we got a triple thread sepia. Uh, 10 of 150. The white version of a uh, 2006 Bowman, and that is uh, 30 of 120. And the 2007 Upper Deck Elements Essential Elements dual jersey. So I had a couple of those, not a whole lot of the number, but uh, now is where it's going to start getting a, a little bit better. Uh, 2005 Prime Patches autograph. This is one of one of his first, actually shown in a Braves uniform. I've um, got the 2005 
Timeless Treasures Bronze Autograph 45 of 50. Slightly undersized top loader, as you can tell from that space there, so not real happy about that. Um, 2007 Upper Deck Black 37 of 50 game day box score. Tim Hudson autograph, so that'll be, uh, I believe that puts me up to 33 Upper Deck Black autos. Uh, I have the 10 of 10 version of this. Uh, I believe I believe it was Adam Giallo picked this one up and sent it to me. And then this is the 9 of 10 from the same set. Uh, 2005 SP Authentic, or the SP Collection, and then this is the Authentic version, because they had that screwy uh, set where they mixed like a couple of different sets into one box. Uh, game used with dirt autograph. Jersey autograph. And then finally, uh, out of 2006, Sweet Spot uh, Signatures on Ball, the red version, 95 out of 99, the red stitch version, and then the red and blue stitch version, both are black ink, uh, and the red and blue stitch is 34 out of 50. Send them in these nice little cases. So I think I did pretty good with that, especially considering what the guy was asking originally. Uh, which was obviously a bit ridiculous, which is why I didn't bid. Uh, but certainly, for that price, uh, I couldn't couldn't pass that up. As you can see, still got the remnants of Christmas around. Uh, still waiting to see a few few friends give them their gifts. Uh, next up, my uh, my father and I uh, found a. A box that he had, that he had picked up some game used and autographs in Arizona when they went out there a few years ago. So I'm going to show them to you guys and uh, let me know if you guys are interested. I'm going to do a separate video because that may run a little bit long. Uh, Baseball King 1010 and uh, Butters, your stuff went out yesterday. Uh, you can check the, the tracking numbers if you like on that. And also check out my photo bucket and eBay. Uh, there's new stuff going up in those regularly. And I uh, hope everyone has a happy new year, as I might not put up another video after the for sale video next, um, until after the new year, depending on my mail. Alright, YouTube. Peace.